Hey guys, welcome back to this lecture service discovery mechanism. In this lecture we will learn about what are the service discovery mechanism natively supported by Prometheus and what are the alternatives if we don't find one. Okay, so let us start with this lecture quickly. As of January 23, Prometheus already supports 25 plus service discovery mechanism currently which includes service discovery in major public clouds as well. Yes, there are few uh, discovery mechanisms which can be implemented for virtual machines running in different public clouds like AWS, Google or Azure. Okay, natively supported service discoveries can be implemented by configuration in the Prometheus configuration file. Okay, now the question comes, okay, we do have the mechanism available, but how do we use them? So that can be used by the configuration file. So what you just need to do, you need to write its configuration into the Prometheus configuration file and then the, your Prometheus process reads the configuration file and it starts uh, identifying or it starts de detecting the resources from those service discoveries. Okay, now for the service discovery mechanism that are not integrated natively in Prometheus, the solution has always been the file, sys file based service discovery. So this is one another alternative which we were talking about. If you are not able to find any natively supported service discover discovery mechanism available in Prometheus, so you can use this file based service discovery. So what actually ha happens here, Prometheus can read YAML and JSON files okay, and update its targets accordingly. So what you can do, you can create a YAML and JSON file format and you can uh, bring or you can uh, push the target configurations in those YAML, in those files and then Prometheus can scrap the target based on the content of that file. Okay, so basically we are saying Prometheus can read the configuration of targets from the YAML and JSON format files and these files can be generated by any mean. If you use an in-house in -house tool or third-party tool, anything. Okay, following is the list of natively supported service discovery configuration available in Prometheus. So let us quickly jump on to the discovery uh, service discovery configuration available to us. Okay, so here you can see these are all the configurations which are available to us for service discovery. Uh, as you might notice, there uh, this particular string underscore sd underscore this is common in all these configurations, so which basically represents the service discovery. Here you can see Azure SD config, console, GCE, HTTP SD config, EC2 SD config, OpenStack. So there are these are around uh, 25 plus service discoveries which are currently available to us, and you can use this configuration to easily. Uh, implement the service discovery so it has some other attributes in the configuration which you need, uh, need to provide based on your uh, target systems and then uh, it is ready to use so this was about this lecture guys uh, in the upcoming lectures we will actually implement the service discovery and we will see how it can help us so thank you so much for watching this i'll see you in the next lecture